友達をさらったんだ。覚悟しろ。Time for a speed down. Let's go, man. Let's go. What's up, YouTube? We are back with another reaction today. Today, we are continuing Eden Zero on episode 10. And,、uh, man, last episode was、um, interesting.、Um, I'm sure you guys remember <laughs> the whole,、uh, what's it called? Gil Planet Gilst and its、um, tasteful、uh, attractions.、Um, <laughs> So, to quickly recap,、uh, Rebecca was kidnapped. Shiki went to go try to rescue her and whatnot.、Um, it seems like she was kidnapped as a beekeeper, and a lot of other beekeepers got kidnapped as well. They went to Planet Gilst, and she's being sold off to this weird frog looking creature named Ilega. And this guy is creepy as hell. He takes girls, right? Picks them naked, puts them in a position, and then turns them into furniture. So, that is his creepy ass fetish. And not even like frog girls, human girls. So, I can't even laugh at this, man. Like, like, people are getting more and more disgusting every day, and their,、uh, their sexual desires are, are, are showing way too much now. People are too comfortable doing these things, and now the media is starting to、uh, normalize as well. <laughs> can't even keep it. <laughs> I can't even say that with a straight face. Anyway. <laughs> Um, so Rebecca's kidnapped.、Um, not a lot really happened. We met Homura, which is、uh, the fourth girl in the whole、uh, Eden Zero trio or quartet.、Um, she seems to have, I think, fire ether gear, but、um, that hasn't been confirmed. But I'm,、uh, it's kind of obvious that it's fire ether gear. Either that or it's like something completely different. Either way, I still, I'm still trying to figure out what ether gear really is and what ether actually is. So. And also, they don't even call it ether, they call it ether gear. So <laughs> that's how they pronounce it in the show, but whatever. Anyway,、um, we're going to get started with、uh, episode 10. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Turn on notifications so you know when I upload next. And for more reactions and many, many more things,、um, check out that Patreon down below.、It、has full uncut reactions of this show and many, many more. And without further ado, we're going to get started with Eden Zero episode 10. Let's get on to this roller coaster. Because <laughs> I'm telling you, this is going to be a very, very、uh, interesting episode.、Uh, but judging by the title, it's called the,、uh, I think, The Great Naked Escape. So <laughs> let's just get started. Yeah, see, the episode title is called The Great Naked Escape. <laughs> Crazy episode title, man. <laughs> 状況がわからないわ。警戒して。はい。ちょうどお前もさ。Wait, it's saying that the appearance is different, but the、uh, authorizing or the code on her、uh, identification code is the same. の仲間をさらったんだ。返せ。なるほど。仕事の依頼ではないということか。倍額で返してやってもいいが。行けよ。エベックはどこだ。やれやれまだ我々に立てつくやからがいたとはな。Yo, like she has like a whole ass army right now to deal with this guy. Crazy. <laughs> so, from what I'm getting with this whole sister thing, it's an imposter? Or is it somebody using her, her body, I guess? Or. I, I, I don't know. Yo, Homura just did something. Yo, that's so cool. Look at that sword. Yo, look at that sword. An ether sword. Bro, yo, she can just produce swords like nothing? Yo, that's actually so cool. Sword ether gear? Soul blade? Yo, that's so cool. That's so cool. Yo! Just like. <laughs> Yo, that's so cool. Yo, that's so cool. Yo, that's so cool. 
Bro, yo, these two are gonna be like really good friends. Players are holy. I, I had a feeling it might be something that was like passed down from like generations or something. さっきほどの襲撃者の件ですか。<笑> <laughs> Dude, you want to know something? That's what I was thinking the whole time, man. Me and Wise, you were thinking the same thing sometimes. <laughs> bro, Iliga's like some next level scumbag, bro. He's like, yo, just because you didn't complete the job, I'm not paying, but I'm gonna enjoy it anyway. <laughs> <笑>クレイジーよ。人間の死体が転がってるはずだ。改造するための準備をしておきなさい。承知でござい。プレパレーションとコンバート。<笑><笑><笑> Bro. The one that looks the most badass here is the one that was faking her life the most. Uh, I don't really understand the science behind this right now. I, I don't even. They haven't even explained to us what the reason is as to why it melts only clothes. <laughs> Bruh, is this why this episode is called The Great Naked Escape? This is so weird. <laughs> This is way too- this is more fan service than any- any, uh, fairy tale thing or whatever that I've seen in my life, man. Dude, watch it not even melt the glass. Watch that glass be, like, plastic or something. <laughs> so dumb. <laughs> if they actually escape like this, is actually so stupid. <laughs> Silencio, old man! あたしたちは平気だよ。誰もいないみたい。扉がある。気をつけて。扉の向こうには兵士がいるんじゃないかしら。そもそも鍵がかかってるかも。あと職員お願い。No, please. No. No, please for the love of God. No. No God. No, God, please, no! 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 Please, no! <laughs> no! Let's go, Kara. Kangu Yuri, you won't change his time. Anta, Nande Kona Kotosuno. In the Poko no Yuko to Kikuno. O Kaneda Kija Kitano Kokoro, Uko Kasena. Betsy, see you nice. Kana got spirit. What is this guy doing, bro? Oh my god. I don't know why, how you're able to, like, just sit here and be comfortable with this. Thank you. Thank you. Time for a speed down. Let's go, man. Let's go. This is so satisfying to watch right now, man. Honestly. No, please. Please don't stop it, man. Shiki, just keep doing whatever you want, man. <laughs> Yo, I love... Bro, I love Shiki so much. 
私の友達のシキとフィーノよ助けに来てくれたのよ皆さんはじめましてあっいる友達がいるんだねおっジェンデータな宇宙忍者見つかったやばいフィーノみんなを頼むこいつは俺がやるその女たちは商品だ逃がすわけにはいかん商品じゃねえ人間だ傭兵団ローグアウトは仕事の邪魔を決して許さんもう何やねん This is a pretty dark episode Planet Ghost is the song like next level I don't even know but I'm excited for this fight right here Bro, like she just kept taking them down like it were nothing, man. Look at Wise thinking, being all happy that he did nothing. What? I wonder what Homura is hiding, man. Seems like Wise figured something out, but hmm. Yo, this robot right here creeps me the hell out, man. Like, yo, million bullets? What? It's basically like upgrading things, like without really upgrading it. Like, High concentration of ether. What? Yo! The chronophage! Yo, a chronophage? There's more than one? There's more than one? So that was episode 10 of Eden Zero. Um, a little bit blown aback by that. <laughs> uh, had a bit of a shock there. Because I was like, oh, this episode is pretty tame. But then, I, I, I don't know, the Great Naked Escape is pretty, it's pretty good. So quick recap there. We had Shiki, you know, um, the whole sister thing. We, um, The whole sister thing, you know, uh, sister started fighting. Homura and Shiki, we learned what Homura's uh, ether gear is, which is um, Soul Sword, which apparently she can, I guess, create swords. I don't know how many she can create. Maybe her limit is two, maybe more. We'll find out. Um, Rebecca and all the other girls um, through a uh, pit of uh, 10 minutes of straight fan service, they actually escaped, and Shiki comes in, kind of helps them out. Beats up that Illiga guy, thank god, man. That guy was, like, pissing me off. But I'm glad, like, he's done and he got his ass kicked. Because he, he, ugh, hate people like that. Characters like those, I know they're meant for story, they're meant to, like, make the story better and, like, make you, like, the villain so hateable. But, like, I just hated that guy. Ugh. I, 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 there's just something about people who, who say that, yo, I have money. So that, that means I can like kill people and do whatever the hell I want. There's something about people like that that just ugh, get me. And, and, not, and not to mention that he was like disgusting and creepy too. That also was kind of um, not, not cool. Anyway, um, quickly along, he saves her. Then we have um, established fight between Shiki and uh, Jin, the robot. And then we also had that other uh, fat thing coming through. Wise um, is a little bit interesting. His whole ether gear, I thought it was like... Him just upgrading things, but I think there's more applications to it. I didn't really like. I thought it was cool before, but then I didn't really think about the the uh, aspects of what he could really do. Like, think about it. He can get like, let's say, a rocket launcher, upgrade it crazy to make it like a homing rocket launcher. You know what I mean? Something like that. Or even worse, it could have like more explosive power. You know, faster speeds. It, anything, right? So. His power is really interesting too. I don't know where his ether gear was for Future Wise because it looks like Future Wise has like robot hands. So maybe he lost his ether gear at some point, you know? But anyway, moving on. Um, Homura, cool, all that stuff. But then 
Yo, that ending was crazy. This, this, uh, what's it called? Um, what's, what's, what's that robot called? The one that oh, runs Eden Zero. They keep saying it, and then I see it, and then I, and then I read it, and then I instantly forget what the name is. There's sister, there's, there's mother, and then there's, mm, ah, whatever. I, I, I'll figure it out. I'll remember. Anyway. She's like, yo, the chronophages take, like, planets are dying one by one. I'm like, what? H like, how did it get to an extreme where planets are dying quickly, right? She's like, yo, the chronophage, a, cro a chronophage, by the way. I thought it was the chronophage. I thought there was only one, like, a legendary creature that goes from planet to planet and, like, sucks out the time from it. No, it's a chronophage. So there's multiple chronophages out there. Like, how does this universe survive if it eats time? That's crazy. Anyway, um, that was a great episode. Episode 10 of Eden Zero. I can't wait to watch episode 11. This this current arc is starting to get really, really heated up. That chronophage part just threw me through a loop, so I'm really excited for the next episode. Um, I think that's it for the video today, guys. I hope you guys all have a great day. I'm really loving the support that you guys are giving me. It's been awesome. I've been loving the uh, Patreon support, YouTube support, all of it. It's honestly great. I thank you all for it. And um, I'll see you guys around. I remember a little bit of a quote for today. Always make sure you get that heart pumping every day. All right, I'll see you guys around.